hello guys welcome to my channel again so this video is in continuation with the previous video uh, and this is an ongoing series which I have created for hacker and Java skill so like I have told before the agenda is to get four star gold um, gold badge for Java or a certificate out of ha hacker rank so that I can actually post that on my LinkedIn profile which will look good and it's free so that's always better so let's start the second challenge so it says that we have to um, use the scanner class <coughs> and then we have to get the input right and then they are printing the input so code above creates a scanner object read a string and an int so it's reading two arguments separated by lines and then it closes the scanner object so that there is nothing to read and then we print it out so our, our output is like my string is and my int is that means that these two are static so let's see sample input is 4200 so we, are, we just have to print it out in the same order that's it so they have already given us the example here so if you haven't used scanner yet you can uh, because we never do that right so uh, like in our actual real project we never do scanner so let's try this so they have created a scanner object they have got the integer value and it says there are three lines of input so uh, so in this case I think the number three is going to be static and then we have to read two more so let's copy this paste it here and then paste it here let's change the values b and c and then copy this print it here print it here and then change the arguments here and then let's try to run this okay so it's working fine so what I'm am I doing here is in the example here they have used two different types of data one is string another is int right and then they were using these two specific system dot out dot print and int to specify that this is string and this is int and they were printing uh, in two different lines and here they were reading from the same line so that's why the methods are different so if the sequence were opposite if it was int and this was string then we ma may have to use the next line in that case okay so um, let's try to submit I think this is all clear because here we are just printing it so like we have to just get next integer that's why we are using next int right so let's submit okay it's working fine so that's good so that was all for this video thank you guys for watching if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please subscribe and have a good day bye bye